Hi, my name is Arnold Custodio and welcome to another InMotion Hosting WordPress video tutorial. Today we will be looking at two different ways to prevent search engines from indexing the WordPress site. The first option is a setting within the reading section of the WordPress administrator. The second way I will be showing you requires that your web host be using cPanel. cPanel includes a security option requiring a username and password to be entered before a folder can be accessed. This can be used to prevent access to your WordPress installation. Using the WordPress Administrator to prevent search engine crawling. In order to use the WordPress Administrator to prevent search engine crawling, you'll need to first log into the dashboard, then click on Settings, and then go to Reading. In the Reading Settings section, you'll see the Search Engine Visibility option here at the bottom. You can click on it to discourage search engines from indexing the site, as it says. Notice that it says it is up to search engines to honor this request. Literally, when this option is selected, WordPress does the following. It writes a line in the head section of the generated WordPress pages. And this line says, meta name equals robots, contents equals no index, and then comma, no follow. This will normally prevent search engine robots to ignore your site. However, although the line is in the header, it is possible for search engines to ignore these requests. These settings must be honored by the search engines in order for them to work. So once you have this option selected, you click on Save Changes in order to save that particular selection. The other option for securing your website from being searched or crawled by search engine robots is to use the cPanel password directory feature. In order to do that, you need to be in the cPanel, and here I've logged in the cPanel. You would scroll down towards the security, and this is the security section, and then you click on password protect directories. So I'm going to go to the directory area where my WordPress site has been installed. And in this case, I'm going to use example.com here. In order to secure, you click on the actual folder name, and then you would click on the option here that says password protect this directory, and you can give it a name for this directory, and then click on save. Once you have the option saved, you would give a username, and this allows you to set the users who have access to this directory, and I'm just going to give a username of user1, and then you set a password. And then once you have set your password, you click on Add or Modify the Authorized User. It will save it. And then you'll see the authorized users in a list at the bottom of the page. This is the username that you will see when you try to log into the WordPress site and you see the Username and Password option appear on the screen. Thanks for watching this InMotion Hosting WordPress video tutorial. If you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up below and subscribe to our channel. Also, please leave us a comment on what you would like to see in future videos. Thanks again for watching and have a great day. Do you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? It's something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com slash support.